Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Please continue standing as Christina Linton sings the national anthem. striped and bright stars through the perilous fight. O'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in the be seated. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Karen Hanna, Dean of the College of Environmental Design. Welcome to our 2006 commencement exercises. On behalf of the faculty, staff, and students of the college, I offer congratulations to our graduates and a special welcome to the families and friends who join us today. Many people worked hard for you to reach commencement day. The faculty who passed the torch of enthusiasm for knowledge and the ability to perform as professionals in your discipline. The staff who provide the ongoing support for learning. And to the many other professionals who give their time and energy to make the college even stronger. Let us recognize them. It now gives me great pleasure to introduce the distinguished members of the platform party. I ask that each of them stand as I read their names, but please hold your applause until they have all been introduced. Dr. J. Michael Ortiz, President of California Poly State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Dr. Tomas Morales, Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs. Dr. Lynn Turner, Vice President for Student Affairs. Patricia Ferris, Vice President for Administrative Affairs. Dr. Deborah Brum, Vice President for Instructional and Information Technology. Scott Warrington, Vice President for University Advancement. Paul Garnett, our valedictorian, outstanding student, and McPhee awardee. Rosanna Salvador, our senior class representative. Dr. Demetrius Pulikaitis, who is our, is our mace bearer. And Noel Vernon, our associate dean. Thank you very much. I would now like to call on President Ortiz for his welcome and introductory remarks. President Ortiz. Thank you, Dean Hanna. Graduates, this will be one of those days that you will remember for the rest of your lives. It's one of those days like your wedding day or like the day your kids are born. Take it all in and enjoy it. 
I know that I'm going to. I know that you've already been wearing out your cell phone cameras and text ma messaging everyone that you know. But if you haven't done this and there are people that aren't here, uh, please let them know that as usual we are webcasting this uh, ceremony and the address to pick it up on the web is video.csupomona.edu and they'll be able to observe as, as those of us that are here can observe live. Since we uh, began the process, we have had over 9,000 hits on the uh, web page and includes over 27 countries, which are United Kingdom, Australia, Philippines, China, Croatia, Israel, uh, Vietnam, Colombia, and many others. So it has been your stars, your stars internationally. Now, one thing that I'd like to, before I begin my comments, is that every year we put on this commencement and it takes a great deal of effort on the part of many volunteers, on the part of students and staff and faculty, but there are three people or two people that really do work hard to get this production done. And uh, I'd like to recognize them. One is Dave Johnson. He has been doing this for 18 years and has personally observed over half of the total number of graduates that have gone and graduated from Cal Poly Pomona. Dave? And the other is Walter Hoplin, who is the one that organizes all of the structural changes here and, sh and the differences that take place and transforms this area so that we can uh, conduct this ceremony. So Walter, thank you. The graduating class of 2006 did not arrive here today by accident. As with any journey, there are people who walked alongside you and helped you along the way. On campus, that begins with a special learning-centered faculty. Take a moment and reflect on that special professor who led you through a rough patch to get you here. For many of you, your parents walked this path, making sacrifices along the way so that you could reach your educational destination. Some of them may have even written a check every now and then. Maybe it was a spouse or a loved one who carried a larger load on the home front so that you could focus on your education. You, the graduating class of 2006, did not get to this commencement exercise alone. Please turn around and join me in giving those special people a well-deserved round of applause. At the beginning of the academic year, I give a State of the University address to our faculty and staff. Last fall, I spoke about the excellence of our programs, our students, and our alumni. Today, I would like to introduce you to some stories of success from the College of Environmental Design. Margaret Sanchez is a unique student in that she is constantly embracing Cal Poly's learning-centered philosophy. She has worked tirelessly as the president of the Art Students Alliance and the American Institute of Graphic Arts. Particularly notable was her involvement this year in the development of the Dot 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 Digital Festival, where along, where along with Professor Arn Andy, she coordinated and organized an evening of digital art. Students were engaged in dialogue and listened to guests talk about the impact of digital technology on the art world. She also helped to organize several weekend book arts workshops and in her spare time participated in the promotion of Earth Day at the Lyle Center. Then there is Rayanne N. Hardigan, Rayanne N. Hardigan, a graduate student in the Urban and Regional Planning Department who represented the program and the university at the 23rd session of the International Workshops of Planning and Urban Design in France. Rayannon was the only American on a team that won the grand prize with their plan, the Ring of Knowledge. 
The four-week workshop included a first week in which each student was charged to make a presentation about a metropolitan territory with high scientific competitiveness. Jose Rosendo Garcia is earning his degree today in landscape architecture. During his first three years with the program, Mr. Garcia helped operate his family's catering business, which included starting work at 5 a.m. in the morning, followed by classes each day on campus. During fall quarter 2005, he attended the Landscape Architecture Italy program and helped fund his attendance as a work-study student at the Santa Chiara Study Center. Currently, Mr. Garcia works part-time with the California Landscape Design in Upland, yet he continues to contribute time and energy to his family's catering business on the weekends. Mr. Garcia epitomizes the commitment and determination that typifies the sustained effort by students like many of you. Please help me recognize these individuals. There is a story behind each and every one of you about the crossroads that you face and the decisions that you made in your life and the people that guided your journey. Now is the time to reflect on those moments. Isaac Newton said that if I have seen further, it is by standing on the shoulders of giants. All of you are waiting to hear your name called and to walk across the stage. That, after all, is why you're here today, and it's certainly why I'm here. But before you leave, I want to stress something very important. No matter where your lives take you, you will always be a member of the Cal Poly Pomona family. This is a time when membership truly has responsibilities. You are representing a wonderful university, one that is building national and international acclaim. Much of the success enjoyed by the, this institution is a result of the efforts of our alumni in their professions and in their communities. Carry on that tradition and proudly let everyone know that you are an alumni of this great university. The difference between a good university and a great one is the amount of private support that it receives. As you look around the campus, projects like Agriscapes, the Farm Store, the Engineering Lab Building, the Collins School for Hospitality Management, the Arantani Japanese Garden, the Lyle Center for Regenerative Studies, the Arabian Horse Center and Biotrek each contribute to making our campus a special place. But they would not be here were it not for private contributions. This is my way of letting you know that I'll be calling on you to help Cal Poly Pomona maintain its reputation and the value of your degree. This request could range from serving as a professor for a day to serving on an advisory board and to, yes, making a financial contribution. One of the ways to stay connected to your alma mater through the Cal, is through the Cal Poly Al Pomona Alumni Association. Through the Alumni Association, you can stay in touch with your university and your classmates. And for those of you in the audience who still haven't purchased a graduation gift, there are members of the Alumni Affairs staff here who can help solve that problem for you. The gift of a membership in the Alumni Association is, as they say, a gift that keeps on giving. On the subject of staying connected, we have a gift from Cal Poly Pomona to the class of 2006. This year's graduates will be the inaugural recipients of a lifetime university email address. We will contact you through your current e ad address to fill you in on the details. Your lifetime email is one way to show that you are a Bronco forever. Today is a new beginning for each of you. I join with the entire faculty and staff of Cal Poly Pomona to say to the class of 2006, congratulations on a job well done. Thank you, President Ortiz. Now I would like to introduce the senior class representative from the College of Environmental Design, Rosanna Salvador, who will present the senior class gift to President Ortiz. Thank you, Dean Hanna. President Ortiz, Dean Hanna, members of the stage party, distinguished guests and fellow members of the class of 2006, 
It is a tradition at Cal Poly Pomona for the members of the graduating class to leave behind not only memories and friends, but a lasting gift to the campus and for the future students at this, our alma mater. The gift from the class of 2006 is lighted crosswalks to make our campus safer for future generations of students. President Ortiz, it is my pleasure to present to you on behalf of the graduating class of 2006, our gift to our alma mater, Cal Poly Pomona. Thank you, Rosanna. I'm sure this is a gift that will be appreciated by many of the future generations of Cal Poly Pomona students. Thank you very much, class of 2006. At this time, I am pleased to have the privilege of presenting the Julian A. McPhee Honor Award for Student Excellence, an award the university has given since 2002. Julian McPhee was the founding president of both Cal Poly Pomona and Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. He provided more than 35 years of dedicated service to the citizens of California. Because of his visionary leadership and astute negotiating skills, Californians can point with pride to two of the nation's finest universities founded on the educational principle of learn by doing. This special award was thoughtfully funded by an anonymous donor who was a colleague of Julian McPhee, and it honors a current graduating senior who exhibits excellence in his or her academic endeavors. It is now my pleasure to present the Julian A. McPhee Award to to the Outstanding Scholar of the College of Environmental Design. This year's honoree from the Department of Urban and Regional Planning is Paul Garnett. Will Paul please join me at the lectern? Over here. Yeah, stand on this side, please. So they can see. Paul Garnett has a formidable in intellect and is an especially adept critical thinker. He is intellectually generous, acting as a discussion leader and facilitating the growth of his fellow students. The faculty especially note his contributions in computer-mediated discussions and activities. Paul is willing to explore new ideas and solutions. He has the insight and perspective of a graduate student, even though he is completing his bachelor's degree. Paul shows exceptional professional potential in the field of urban and regional planning, but he would be equally successful pursuing graduate education and a scholarly career. His GPA is 3.99. Paul won the California Planners Foundation Continuing Student Scholarship and the URP Award for Academic Achievement and Professional Promise. Paul Garnett will make a lasting contribution in the field of planning. The faculty are unanimous in their feeling that it has been a privilege to have him as a student. President Ortiz, will you join us at the podium? Each year at commencement, I have the privilege of recognizing individuals from the college community who have excelled. I would like to call them to the stage now. I ask that each of them join me, all of them join me now, and I, then I will introduce them individually. From architecture, we are recognizing two students, Rafael Lopez and Crystal Wong. Please come to the stage. From the art department, Nolan Kabaji. From landscape architecture, 
Maria Landoni de Rose. From the Lyle Center for Regenerative Studies, Jonas Swick. And from Urban and Regional Planning, Paul Garnett. An award is given to a graduating student from each department who is recognized for excellence in academic performance, design capability, and contributions to the life of the department and the college. All have distinguished themselves as members of our environmental design community. As I call your name, please step forward. Rafael Lopez. Rafael Lopez, <laughs> Rafael Lopez embodies the best characteristics and values of an architectural student at Cal Poly Pomona, a young architect of an immense talent and remarkable mastery of a wide range of professional tools. Rafael was recently chosen as a team member to represent the school at two prestigious events, the one to two design charrette competition and the 2 by 8 exhibition at the A plus D Museum in Los Angeles. A skillful designer and artist, Raphael has also proven to be an insatiable learner, interested in a variety of social and cultural issues. Finally, Raphael stands out as a leader whose talent is matched by his likable personality and social skills. Krista Wong. As indicated by one of her former instructors, each time Krista Wong's project was singled out as an exemplary one, her classmates received it as a well-anticipated turn of events, and for good reason. Krista was a recipient of Design Excellence Awards at the end of both her first and second years at Cal Poly Pomona, was selected to participate in the highly competitive international program, and showed a remarkably consistent performance in all of her classwork. Most recently, her group's project submitted for the Grand Avenue competition was featured on the front page of the LA Times Sunday Current section. A talented and thoughtful designer and an excellent scholar, Crystal has also been recognized by her professors and peers for her character, integrity, and demeanor. The excellence of her designs and her schoolwork has not elicited envy from her classmates because they al she also has been a role model of modesty, dignity, and friendliness. <laughs> Nolan Kabaji from the Art Department. The art department selected Nolan Kabaji as the outstanding senior as he is a dedicated student with a high GPA who approaches his studies with professionalism, creativity, and a strong work ethic. During his tenure in the department, Nolan has gained the respect of both students and faculty. He has produced outstanding work in his classes, exhibited pieces in the 2D, 3D show, and worked as an assistant in the downtown Pomona Center. We are proud of his impressive contributions to Cal Poly Pomona. <laughs> From the Department of Landscape Architecture, we are honoring Maria Landoni de Rose. Maria Landoni de Rose was named to the President's Honor List at Cal Poly Pomona in 2004 and 2005. In 2005, she also was awarded the first ever American Society of Landscape Architects Council of Fellows Scholarship, a national recognition. In her junior year at Cal Poly Pomona, Maria became active in the student chapter of the American Society of Landscape Architects and helped to organize the ENV Career Day and in 2006, she chaired the event. 
Maria's other achievements include design awards from the Inland Empire's Utility Agency and the Los Angeles Arboretum. The Department of Landscape Architecture at Cal Poly Pomona congratulates Maria Landoni de Rose for her many achievements. From the Lyle Center for Regenerative Studies, this is our first graduating class from the Lyle Center. We are, honorating, we are honoring Jonah Swick. As a member of the Lyle Center for Regenerative Studies inaugural class, Jonah Swick has consistently demonstrated excellence in the Master of Science program. His academic performance has been strong in his courses, as well as his thesis research, which examined heating and cooling properties of super adobe construction. He has been a vital member of the Lyle Center community, serving as president of the Green Team Student Club, and aiding in re outreach efforts as a research assistant on a sustainable housing project for underserved communities in Tijuana, Mexico. The faculty and staff of the Lyle Center congratulate Jonah on his many accomplishments and his receipt of this award. From the Department of Urban and Regional Planning, we recognize Paul Garnett, whose achievements have already been extolled. Let's congratulate all of our high achievers. some of our high achievers. Will Professor Bill Adams please join me at the podium? Each year, an award is given recognizing an outstanding faculty member. This year, we are proud to recognize Bill Adams from the Department of Architecture. Bill Adams joined the Cal Poly Pomona faculty in 1984 as a full-time lecturer, teaching a wide range of design studios. He was promoted to full professor and tenured in 1990. Professor Adams served as chair of the Department of Architecture from 1998 to 2002 effectively seeing the department through a period of considerable change. He entered the faculty early retirement program in 2003. Professor Adams has been among the most respected and accomplished design faculty members in the department. Students have clamored to enroll in his design courses, enjoying his easygoing demeanor, but more importantly, respecting his continual demand for design excellence. His students have produced work that is representative of the department's best efforts. He has served as a mentor to students and colleagues in both the professional and academic worlds of architecture. His continued service to the department as a design instructor has provided new faculty members with a role model for teaching excellence in the design studio. As an architect, Professor Adams has been recognized with numerous design awards from the American Institute of Architects. His work has been widely published and prominently featured on the covers of several internationally recognized journals. He has also served the design community as a juror for awards programs and as a member of the Santa Monica Design Review Board. His outstanding level of design achievement led to his recognition as a fellow of the American Institute of Architects, one of the most important career distinctions an architect can achieve. 
we are happy to be adding this award to his already distinguished career. I would now like to call upon the Provost and Vice President for Vi Academic Affairs, Dr. Tomas Morales, to present the candidates for the master's degrees. Provost Morales. Thank you, Dean Hanna. Will the candidates for the Master of Architecture, the Master of Landscape Architecture, Master of Science and Regenerative Studies, and Master of Urban and Regional Planning please rise. President Ortiz, I present to you the 2006 candidates for the Master of Architecture, Master of Landscape Architecture, Master of Science and Regenerative Studies, Master of Urban and Regional Planning. These candidates have completed the requirements for the master's, de master's de degree as prescribed by the State of California and the trustees of the California State University and they have been recommended by the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Candidates for the master's degree, you have heard the recommendation of the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. By the authority vested in me as president, I confer upon you the degree of Master of Architecture, Master of Landscape Architecture, Master of Science in Regenerative Studies, and Master of Urban and Regional Planning with all the rights, honors, and opportunities appertaining thereto. Congratulations. Please be seated until you are directed to the stage to receive your master's hood. As we proceed through the march of the graduates, each graduate will have a picture taken by the professional photographers, and each graduate who turns in a photographer's card at the reader table will receive a proof. Ushers, please take your positions to help marshal the candidates. Will the candidates for the mar master's degrees please rise? Each candidate should approach the stage as directed by the ushers. With your hood folded over your left arm, stop at the reader table, proceed to the platform to receive your diploma cover, and be hooded. And then recess down the center ramp and back to your seat, again as directed by the ushers. We will now begin with a hooding of the Master of Architecture graduates. We ask that these graduates come forward. Will the architecture faculty who will be doing the hooding please come to the stage and will the remaining architecture faculty form a line at the bottom of the ramp to greet the new graduates. Layla Joseph Lewis. Norman Nicole Florendo.
Department of Architecture. Hyuk Kwan. Tara Jane Young. This completes the hooding of the Master of Architecture graduates. We now begin the hooding of the Master of Landscape Architecture graduates. We ask that these graduates now come forward. Will the Landscape Architecture faculty who will be doing the hooding please come to the stage? And will the remaining Landscape Architecture faculty form a line at the bottom of the ramp to greet the new graduates? Angela Meggert. Pamela Jean Conrad. Tori Chair. Gregory Thomas Barger. Jessica Bagwell. Claire Good. Ken Frederick. Andy Lola. Steven Storheim. Ginny Lee. Mundo Jose Murguia. Elisa Rodrigo Santiago. Riaz Adikalam. Jamie Yamashita. <laughs> this completes the hooding of the graduates of the, land, of the Master of Landscape Architecture program. We now begin the hooding of the Master of Science in Regenerative Studies. We ask that these graduates now come forward Will the regenerative studies faculty who will be doing the hooding please come to the stage? And will the remaining regenerative studies faculty form a line at the bottom of the ramp to greet their new graduates? Douglas Kent. Jonah Bennett Swick. This completes the hooding of the graduates from the Master of Science in Regenerative Studies. We now begin the hooding of the Master of Urban and Regional Planning graduates. We, we ask that these graduates now come forward. Will the Urban and Regional Planning faculty who will be doing the hooding please come to the stage? And will the remaining Urban and Regional faculty form a line at the bottom of the ramp to greet their new graduates? Juliana Von Hock Cherry. Jessica Cayetano Wilkinson. Sock Angelo Smith Yomul. Ebony J. McGee. Adam Neil Villani. Carolina Gonzalez. Nathan Michael DeBoom. John Earl Hildebrand, the third. 
Edmelin S. Villanueva. Scott Albert Hutter. Rhiannon Lamb Hardigan. Aquila Hurd. We have completed the hooding of this year's graduates with the Masters of the Masters degree programs. Let us congratulate them. Candidates for the baccalaureate degree, you have heard the recommendation of the faculty of the California State Polytechnic. Whoop, excuse me. Will the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Architecture, Bachelor of Art, Bachelor of Fine Art in Graphic Design, Bachelor of Science in Landscape Architecture, and Bachelor of Urban and Regional Planning, please rise. President Ortiz, I present to you the 2006 candidates for the baccalaureate degree in the College of Environmental Design. These candidates have completed the requirements for the baccalaureate degree as prescribed by the State of California and the trustees of the California State University. And they have been recommended for their degrees by the faculty of the California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Candidates for the baccalaureate degree, you have heard the recommendation of the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. By the authority vested in me as president, I confer upon you the degree of Bachelor of Architecture, Bachelor of Art, Bachelor of Fine Art and Graphic Design, Bachelor of Science and Landscape Architecture, and Bachelor of Urban and Regional Planning. with all the rights, honors, and opportunities appertaining thereto. Congratulations. In academic tradition, the student who has not yet earned a degree wears the tassel on the mortar board on the right side. When the degree is conferred, the scholar moves the tassel to the left and joins a select company. In recognition of your new status, will all recipients of the baccalaureate degree move the tassel to the left? To the class of 2006, I commend you for your effort and accomplishments. Please be seated until you are directed to the stage to receive your diploma cover. Ushers, please begin directing the graduates to the stage. Will the recipients of the degree of Bachelor of Architecture please come forward to accept their diplomas? And will the faculty of the Department of Architecture who are doing the presenting of diplomas please come to the stage? And will the additional faculty, remaining faculty of the Department of Architecture please line up to greet the new graduates?
Nicholas Georgiakopoulos. Frank Raul Castillo. Matthew Curtis Nicholson. Joseph Neil Napto. Manuel Garcia Trujillo, Jr. Jason Glenn Bulanza. Andrew Jason Hernandez. Clarissa Pearl Lau, Honors Program. Jackie Munoz. Gregory Allen Bossi. Mauricio Carranza. Gabriel Herrera. Ruby Rose Sanchez. Obed Ortiz, cum laude. Alondra Rodriguez. Adrian Menares. Karina Elise Mills. Rafael Lopez. Lisa Tran. Eric Sebastian Sombrano. April Kaufman. Octavio Alfonso Rocha, magna cum laude. Philip Van Wynn. Kristen Marie Matthews. Taehyun Kim. Jacqueline T. Nguyen. Giwoong Tim Song. Alan Averbach. Cristobal Nahui Ortega. Christopher Ray Wu. Fan Quang Tu. Will Lima. Elizabeth Ann Durbin. Adam Harwell, cum laude. Paige R. Robbins. Jennifer Weiming Wang. Armini Malsasian, cum laude. Thomas Frederick Bardwell. Mark Chan. Andrew Takabayashi. Siavash Lagmani. Yontel James Carter. Eric Allen Sipuentes. Savak Karabakian. Julia Law. Eric Timothy Scott, cum laude. Fernando Cruz. Erica Martin. Crystal Wang, cum laude. Naomi Beth Getz. Renata Shrakova. Mark McKinney. Heather Elaine Hughes. Wenling Wu. Shireen Shamsheldeen Gonda. Kelly Hiroko Khan. Kui Lai, cum laude. This completes the awarding of diplomas for the Bachelor of Architecture graduates. Will the recipients of the degree of the Bachelor of Art and Bachelor of Fine Art in Graphic Design please come forward to accept their diplomas. Will the faculty who will be awarding the diplomas please come to the stage and will the art department faculty please line up to greet their students at the base of the ramp. Thank you. Will the art department faculty who are presenting the diplomas please come to the stage? Nolan Agbulos Kabehi. Jeremy Eugene Gleason. 
Tracy Lynn Fong, cum laude. Margaret Sanchez. Mario Jesus de Luna. Joshua Philip Baldonero. Timothy Lance McMullins. Juan Francisco Sierra. William James. Didier Ernesto Andrade. Brian Curtis Bachelor. Pao Ling Che. Alexis Michelle Wilson. Kanako Akito. Joseph Manuel Rodriguez. Alex Lee. Leticia R. Perez. Nancy Chewy. Roxanne Lizette Hernandez. David Matthew Langeth. Amanda Catherine LaRue. Gracella Renee Guillen. Chris Philip Noriega. Sarah Panahi. Luis Giovanni Hernandez. Natalie Hernandez. Michael Christopher Pocket. Robin Tracy Young, magna cum laude. Carmen Elena Ayala. Sal In. Mirta Jeanette Benitez. Rita Alexis Garcia, summa cum laude. Marisol Jimenez. Jeff Ryan Fontalera, cum laude. Rachel Koo. Carlos Soledad Gonzalez, summa cum laude. Wei Kai Lu. Kevin May. Hien Hu Chow. <laughs> Ratha Sok. Sunny Tong. Gita Agahi. Chen Hua Wang. Mary Rose Celine Urias Tang. Corey Liu. Fabian Eduardo Lucero. Jimmy B. On. Philip Jason Antonucci. Yoon Kyung Lee. Jeffrey Shi. Tran Huyen Cynthia Trin. Susan Su Young Kim. Xiaohua Liang. Ed L. Buenaventura. Ramon Avila Ayala Jr. Mario Martino. Lydia C. Wahlberg. Sam Yi. Stephanie Jane Eder. Michael Aaron Estrada. Valeria Guevara. Eric Ikeda. Jonathan Stephen Ang Lee. Christy Saley. Linda Huang Wen. Hin Trong Nguyen. Alejandro Rene Santander. Jane Marr. Robert Charles Bell. Catherine Song. Chun Wei Chen. Afriana Simbolon. Justin Gill Moore Brown. Karina Chan. Gregory Martin Beckman. Christopher Robert Lichtart. Chandler David Cruz. Raham Abel Delaiz. Nemo Reyes Diestro. Dina Asal. Alejandra Zaragoza. Lisa Ann Bond. Paul Chuho. Mark Espinola Marquez. Frederick Garcia. Alan Lawrence Wade. This completes the awarding of diplomas to the Bachelor of, of Art and of the Bachelor of Fine Art in Graphic Design candidates. We will now award diplomas to the graduates of the Landscape Architecture Program. Will the Bachelor of Science in Landscape Architecture students please come forward? Would the faculty who will be awarding the diplomas please come on stage and will the faculty
who will be congratulating the new graduates line up at the bottom of the ramp. Many thanks. Dylan David Deers, cum laude. Rosanna Copeland Salvador. Christopher Duke Kent. Lauren Ann McCullough. Corey Dean Fox. Jason Thomas McHugh. Eric James McWillam, William, magna cum laude. Joseph Daniel McNichol. Daniel Lee Miller. Edward L. Bailey. Jennifer Beth Berkeland. Edward Velasquez, Jr. Jennifer Mary Cable. Sarah Mondragon. Samantha Ann Moran. Jill Ray Van Sickle, cum laude. Yu Sun. Keep coming forward. Joel Christian Schaefer, magna cum laude. Maria Landoni De Rose, cum laude. Kyle John Simon. Michelle Marie Landis. Kristen Itahara, cum laude. Julia Nicole Ledbetter. Kathleen Michelle Ledesma. Sonia E. Noriega. Annabelle Ruiz. Andrew M. Rivlin. Robert Andrew Nava. Mary Ann Bennett, cum laude. Alex Ramos San Diego. Andrew Ezekiel Benson. Salvador Salazar. Joseph Carrickian. Gennaro Diaz. Corey Lindsay. Cesar Omar Davalos. Jose Luis Aguila. Matthew William Lockwood. Ramiro Rigoberto Arroyo Jr. Pedro A. Quijas. Francisco Javier Fernandez. Michael Kim. Angie June. Yoshihito Nagata. Michelle Chow Lysia. Juan Carlos Reyes Comilla. Esther Ilwa Sun. Elizabeth Silva. Helen Hannah Kim. Jose Rosendo Garcia. Wendy Chan. David Gust Mabs. Edvin C. Santiago. Danny Wang. Philip Lee Stevens. Trong Tony Lehun. Dominic Paul Masiello. Nicholas Andrew Strawby. Bryce Charles Carnell. Daniel Christopher Petrick. This concludes the awarding of diplomas to the graduates of the Bachelor of Science in Landscape Architecture. We will now be awarding diplomas to the graduates of the Bachelor of Urban and Regional Planning Program. Will those faculty who will be handing out the diplomas please come to the stage and will the remaining faculty please line up at the bottom of the ramp to greet their graduates. <laughs> Margaret Ellen Bulat. Lauren Gabrielle Flores. Christina Grabo. Michael Ryan Allen. Kristen Leanne Hoy. John David Talon Jensen. Lawson Chen. Nathaniel Dottie. Christian Ivan Arias. Jim Pitya Nukarn. Kenya Jezebel Hueso. David Jin Atwater. Simon S. Shin. Arthur Pignon. Julie Ann Anderlich. Monica Alexandra Moretta, cum laude. 
Margaret Lynn, cum laude. Nathan Monway Chong. Sharam Dirakshan Hore. Ivy Than Hang. Jane Lee. Julie Hong. Heidi Aguilar. Robert David Aguirre. Albert Cisneros. Marlon Regisford. Daniel Roy Hernandez. David Alvarez. Fernando Rios. Nina Behar Shabazz. Veronica Francis Holliday. Michael David Martin. Robert Pack. Nicole Alicia Horvitz. Gianna Marie Parco. Eric Michael Elder. Justin John Cullimore, magna cum laude. Timothy Allen Spencer. Brian John Sitton Jr. Brenda Benitez. Kristen Ann Martinez. Oliver Netburn. Monique Janine Diaz. Paul Garnett, summa cum laude. Daniel Eugene Gornitsky. Renee Andrea Boyce, cum laude. Areli Monares. Tabitha Marie Cavari. Carolina Macias. Paul Lin Tao Vu. Brandon Christopher Campos. Sarah Ann Boab. Angela Denizia Landaverde. Kim Mai Lei, cum laude. George Fernando Espinosa. Sylvia Maria Taruno Artiles. Juan Felipe Rojas. Christopher Jameson Palmer. This concludes the awarding of diplomas for the College of Environmental Design. Congratulations to the graduating class of 2006. Please remain standing for just one moment. Now let us recognize the graduates' families. We owe a sincere debt of gratitude to all of you, the families and other supporters of our students who made it possible for these new graduates to come to Cal Poly Pomona. Once again, we salute and thank you. Thank you. Please be seated. As each graduate leaves campus today, I would like you to reflect upon what you have gained since you came to Cal Poly Pomona. I hope that you count many things besides your diploma and that you will value these. I hope that you have come to love learning and that it will continue to be a lifetime pursuit. I hope that you have learned to set and achieve high standards, and this too will be a life goal. I hope that you have made many friends among your classmates and among the faculty. In every way, I wish you the very best as you begin the next chapter of your life. Once again, congratulations. Will the audience please remain seated during the recessional? At the conclusion of the faculty recessional, our 2006 commencement will be formally concluded. The art department will host a reception in the Kellogg Art Gallery where you may see their students' work. The other departments will host a reception in Building 7 where you may see student exhibits from all the other departments. Thank you for being with us. Thank you.